Some people say that I'm obsessed by food. I don't get that, but actually, it's probably right. Because everything that I do in my life is all about the food. You know, day to day, it's all about the coffee shops, the cafes, going to work, cooking dinner. If I'm going on holiday, there's a food destination at the end. So when I put my new book together, which was Gary Megan's favourites, what on earth am I going to put in there? I reckon I wrote down about 300 ideas and then whittled them down to 100 odd of my absolute best ones. So I'm going to cook a recipe out of this book today, which is trout with quinoa, cucumber and mint. And it's nice and easy, it's a good midweeker, and it's really good for you. Surprising, isn't it? I can cook healthy food. So let's go. So to cook it, simple, just boil it basically. But I tend to use a, an absorption method, which is nice and easy. So if you use half a cup of quinoa, and just over a cup of water, so and a splash. So you bring that to the boil, take a few minutes, turn it down to a gentle simmer. So that'll take about 12 minutes all up to cook. And in the meantime, we're gonna cook the trout. A little bit of salt and pepper. So I use flake salt always when I'm cooking. And we'll take that over to the frying pan. It doesn't have to be super hot. And then pop the fish fillets, skin side down. And the reason we cook fish on the skin is so that it protects that delicate flesh. That. We'll leave that on the skin for about five to six minutes just to crisp up and start the cooking process. That's the quinoa. And it basically goes into get those little fluffy grains. Really delicious. So a bit of salt, a bit of pepper. Don't have to, but I love a touch of olive oil. It also keeps the grains nice and separate. Yum. What's happened with the fish? You can see that it's nice and crispy on the skin. And it's all you can see, it's still a little rare in the middle. You can see that little opaqueness there. But what I'm looking for is those little signs of that white albumin coming out of the fish, which is the, the protein. So what I'm going to do is turn it over and just let it sit there for one or two minutes. So our cooking components of the dish are now done and nice and easy. So that was the quinoa that took 12 minutes and the fish that took about eight or nine. So let's put it together. Now, I've got some thick Greek yogurt, some cucumbers. And I'm just going to slice those. I'm going to put a few of those in. Also got some currants, a pinch of sumac. And then you see what I'm doing? I'm sort of building a salad in the bowl. And then some fresh herbs. So there you go. That's my trout with yogurt, quinoa, currants, and a little sumac. 